Welcome back to the adventures of Link Sir the Night Cats. We have returned to Lakeview Manor to do some work on the house, craft some new gear, enchant some things, uh, add some decorations. Let's head inside. So, in between the end of last video and this video, I went around White Run and Solitude, and I bought up some things from the general store and the blacksmiths, general crafting kind of stuff. I also stole just a eensy weensy little bit of stuff. I I may have like uh, completely emptied out a shop or two, maybe, maybe. So anyway, um, first thing I want to do is something in this room first. So notice. Notice this room. It's big. It's mostly empty, except for our our big... Uh, it's not a moose. I guess it's an elk. Big elk face up there. Notice the lighting. The lighting is uh, global and kind of uniform. <coughs> Excuse me. And it's, uh, it's very kind of plain. There's no shadows. There's no brightness anywhere. Everything is kind of feels flat and dead and lifeless and horrible. So, um, let's see what we can do here. We're gonna make... What do I want to make? What do I want to make? Where is it? Okay, I'm not seeing what I'm looking for here. Okay, let's look at <laughs> little anticlimactic. Um, let's look in a different room. Let's look in this workbench. I wonder why I don't see that there. What I'm looking for. Wall sconce. This is what we're looking for. Okay. I want to make two of these. I need to make some iron fittings. So let's head downstairs and craft some iron fittings. Let's just make a bunch of them. Uh, it's possible I have some in boxes. But let's go ahead, let's come over here. I know I have a, a bunch of ore, so let's go ahead and smelt it up while we're here. Let's just do a bunch. Um, and then let's do some steel. Whoop. Okay, that's good enough. And then let's go to the blacksmith forge. Building materials. Fittings. Let's make a lot, because we're going to need a lot of these things. Basically, everything you hang up on the wall needs some of this stuff. Yeah, let's make some hinges. And yeah, maybe a lock or two. And some nails. Okay. That'll do us for a little while. Let's head back upstairs, and we'll return back down here in a little while to do some crafting. But, uh, up here, let's see. Okay, first thing first, let's come over here. Let's add some wall sconces. Let's see, we need two wall sconces. Yes! Oh, and now we have more in miscellaneous, huh? Oh, are those outside? Okay, let's add some in here. Oh ho! Hey, hey, hey! Ho ho ho! Do we notice a difference? Look at that! We have now candles! And they're adding a bright spot and a dark spot. Look how much vibrant the space is just from that. Lovely! No bright spot and dark spot there. It's still flat. Okay, uh, let's try and find some other places where we can do that. Let's see if we can add some in this room. Miscellaneous wall sconces. And let's do a lamp stand. Let's do this lamp stand. What about this? Exterior. I guess, do these go outside of the house? On the other side of the wall, I suppose? Oh yes, looking better, okay. Let's come over here to this room. Looks fairly flat in here as well. We need to upgrade the lighting. Miscellaneous. I guess we'll do chandeliers here. And I'm running low on goat horns already. Alright. Is that better? 
Yeah, a little bit better. Yeah. Okay. Um, why can't I add some from that? I'm very low on on uh, <laughs> goat. I went and bought like all the goat horns in White Run and Solitude. And now it seems like I cannot un add any more. This is the uh, Penatus Oculatus armor right there. Uh, here's one. Let's see if we can add some here. Chandeliers. Okay. And now I'm out of good horns. Okay. So that's all the lighting we can do for this episode. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's see. And I think I, I did not show off the, the stuff I added to this room. I don't think so. Or maybe I did. I added the uh, the Thieves Guild stuff here. The different armors I got from the Thieves Guild and the uh, Assassin's Guild. These may change over time as I get new new gear. And then in here, we're going to plant a bunch of plants. But first, um, let's get some crafting done. Let's look in here. Oh, what did I just pick up? I don't know. Or I just dropped something. I want to see if there's any crafting stuff in here that I might want. Glass. Give me all that glass. Oh, I have another goat horn there. Give me all the glass. The goat horn. The hinges. Ooh, this chest is very laggy. It has way too many items in it. And so anytime I open it, the game lags out pretty bad. So I actually need to start divvying up stuff so that everything isn't uh, stored in one area. Okay, I think all that stuff can stay there. I think I dropped something in there, though, but... Okay, that's all fine. Uh, I think it's a lot of it has to do with this. All the books are in here. There's a lot of potions in here. <laughs> There's a lot of all that in here. Uh, okay, so I want to craft some stuff. Um... And I need gems. I, th I think all the gems are downstairs. Yeah, okay, so let's go do that. Let's go do that right now. Or, or actually, before we do that, let's look in here. I want to see if I have any miscellaneous items before I turn a bunch of uh, animal pelts into leather. Let's see. Not a goat head. I thought... Do I have to click on these guys individually? Oh, I do. I see. So let's see if I have the items to make any of these. Looks like I don't. Um, I'm missing some bear claws, some straw. Straw. Straw is what I need. Okay. I'm just going to need to be on the lookout for straw. That's the one I'm missing to start mounting items there. So let's head downstairs. And uh, start crafting some stuff. I decided to keep all this miscellaneous crap around until I was finished filling out the rooms with uh, furniture. Got some dwarven gear on this guy, but I think we're going to change that soon. Let's look. Actually, before we oh, get into that, let's open this box. Get out my smithing ingredients. You know what? Mmm. Let's look at the smithing ingredients, or smithing gear I have. 20%. I was wondering if I could make some better stuff, but maybe we'll wait for that a little bit. Uh, where's my other one? Minor alchemy. Cr created potions. I shouldn't have that on me. Unless I just stole a different one. Let's see. <laughs> I have so much stuff in my... Uh, there, there's one. Smith chest. Smith neck. Smith ring. There we go. Okay. Oh, boy. Very encumbered. That's alright, though. No big deal. Then let's get out a bunch of smithing stuff. Uh, I don't think I have anything I really need to drop. Let's get out... a bunch of gems. So that we... I, I don't need all of these. It's just um, quicker to grab them all, then to split them up, because I don't know ahead of time which ones I'm going to want, which ones I won't want. Let's get all the ingots. It's okay if I'm encumbered, because everything's located next to each other, which is very handy. Uh, all the ores. 
Gonna smelt us up some ebony gears. Uh, the pelts can stay. So I've got plenty of leather and leather strips. And I uh, might as well make some more arrows right there. Primer scrap metal, dragon scales. Alright, the rest of that stuff can stay. Oh! Oh, I'm so slow. Oh, so heavy. Oh, so heavy. Here we go. Alright, first thing first, let's use the smelter. Um, let's start at the top and then work our way down. Ebony. Oh, quick. Gold. Moonstone. Quicksilver. And then silver. Uh, corundum. Oh, let's do some steel. Let's not forget the steel. And I have a pretty good amount of iron, but let's go ahead and do some more. Because you use a iron to make a lot of the, uh, the building materials, like the fittings and the hinges and the nails and all that kind of stuff. Alright, that's good enough. Okay, now let's head to <laughs> let's just turn around and use the blacksmith forge. And let's see, ebony gear. So I've got uh, 29 ingots, and I basically want to make one of everything. It's heavy armor, so it's not something I'm going to be wearing anytime soon. Uh, later in the game, once I've maxed out all the stealth stuff, I might go down some different trees just to have new things to do. But for now, let's start with the weapons. Let's go with a bow. That thing is sexy. We're going to make a new bow, that's for sure. Let's make two daggers. Uh, heavy. Let's make uh, a great sword. Hey, hey, smithing to 82. Let's make um, some normal swords. Do we want swords or axes? They're all kind of cool looking. Oh, I think I want the swords. They look really sleek and sneaky looking. I want two of those. I'm going to enchant some new swords. As long as they're better than what I'm already using, I'm going to replace what I'm using. Let's make a, a, a war axe. Let's make a war hammer. We're down to eight, so it looks like the armor is going to have to wait uh, until I get more ebony. Haven't made a mace yet. Battle out. Ooh, look at that. I have to make one of those. And then, um, we're not going to make any arrows for now until we've made a full suit of the armor. So let's finish out with the mace. There we go. And while we're here, let's make some more arrows. Can always use more arrows. There we go. Alright, anything else we want to make? Jewelry, gold diamond necklace. 1200 value! So uh, the way it works in the Elder Scrolls games, uh, the more valuable the item, the more as far as jewelry is concerned, um, the more powerful the enchant it can hold. So a, a gold diamond necklace is something you want. You want to be able to make that so you can make a really good enchanted item. I'm going to make a ring as well. Let's make a couple. Yeah, yeah, smithing up to 84. Let's make a... Nah, no, not that one. Let's see, what options we got? Silver emerald, that's worth 830. 500, 550, 700, 900, 900, there we go. Maybe we'll just make a bunch of rings for a variety of things. Okay. Uh, let's see, anything else we can really make? We got up to 84 just from that. That's pretty good. Um, I'm going to save my other stuff for improving gear in a minute. Okay. Yeah, still encumbered. Um, okay, so next step, we want to improve things. Do I have a potion of smithing on me? Fortify smithing three. 40% better, good. Okay, so we're going to um, use that to improve that. Uh, weapons here and armor here all at once. And I want to look at, uh, see if I have all the items I require to do that. So that takes an ingot of steel. I've got a zillion of those. No biggie. Whoops. Nope. That's not what I meant to do. 
So I want to make sure I have all the items I need before I use that potion. So right here, see, I'm, I'm out of ebony. Yeah, I don't have the items I require for any of this. So I'm going to need more ebony ingots. I have moonstone. Why won't it let me improve this? Is it because it's already improved to the max? I wonder. That, I wonder if that's the reason. So anyway, I'm going to need... Uh, let's see, I want to improve my two ebony daggers. I'm going to need two ingots for that. I want to improve the bow. That's a third ebony ingot. Um, I'm guessing it won't let me improve that. Let's see what happens. You lack the skill. Yeah, okay, so it must be because I, uh, I've already improved it as much as possible. Until I take that potion, that may change things. But I have, I have plenty of Quicksilver. Um, okay, so I need some Malachite as well. Three Ebonies and a couple of Malachite, I guess. What's Grim Sever? Malachite, two Malachites. Moonstone I have plenty of. All right, let's check out the armors. Oh, oh, so slow. Uh, we're still using our glass stuff. We could improve this. I guess no reason not to. Uh, we don't really need to improve our crafting gear. Malachite. Malachite. Okay, so uh, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to uh, stop the recording for a bit and go try and get some ebony and some malachite. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> and who's... Let's head back over here very slowly. Ah, very slowly. Here we go. Any day now. Any day now. Okay, here we go. Let's activate the large trophy base, miscellaneous. Uh, I can put a frost troll, a horker, a troll, and a wolf. Frost trolls are rather impressive. Ooh, and they've got a nice Oh, different poses. Look at that. Same same requirements, same materials. This one's gnawing on a bone. This one is uh, getting ready to catch something, like a giant uh, bouncy ball or something. Let's see, what are the other options? I, I definitely want a snow bear and like with a snow cat. If it's on the list, maybe it's not. Uh, what else we got? These Draugr guys are pretty impressive looking. I need five Bone Meal and an Ancient Nord Sword. That's easy to come up by. Dragon Skull requires Dragon Bone. Which, I have one of those too. There's a bear. Two bears. Alright, well let's put a... This guy wants to catch something. Let's put him up. Pow! Look at that! Okay, um... Okay, that's good enough for now. I just wanted to see if I could do that. Should we add some lighting in here? Let's see if we can do that. Miscellaneous wall sconces. Added to. Okay, is it a little brighter in here now? A little, uh, or at least a little bit more dynamic in the lighting? How about in here? No. Uh, okay, well, we'll come back to that. So I have a few goat horns left. First, more importantly, let's make some gear. Actually, I already have it. Uh, but now, I have ebony and malachite ingots on me. Let's see, how many did I get? I got six ebony and 26 malachite. Should be enough. Um, let's check again. Because uh, I want to do a little compare and contrast with what the potion does. So here's the ebony bow. That'll go up to 64. So we'll use that as a baseline. That's going to say ebony bow is 64. We're wearing all our gear. I may make better gear eventually, sooner or later. But now is the time. Uh, where is it? Fortify smithing. Here we go. 40% better. And this timer. I don't think it runs out at all when I'm in this inventory because the uh, the game is paused more or less. 
All the way to 72. Okay, uh, let's look at Nightingale Bow. So this is an ebony bow, I think. Do they look the same? No, it's not an ebony bow. It's something else. Maybe it's like a black elven bow. I'm not sure. What about Succubus? That's an elven bow. That'll go to 63. Grimsever's gonna go all the way up to 41. So that's gonna go up to 72, which is way better than 55. And then we can put an enchantment on it. So I think it's gonna be my new main bow. So let's go ahead and do that. So I've only got, uh, I've only got, well, five ingots of ebony now. So I have to sort of pick and choose what I improve and what I don't. Why can I not improve these now? I wonder. Ebony sword. Okay, so my scrapple left and right. I could. Did my potion run out? It shouldn't have. I can't improve these anymore though. That's weird. But uh, these will go up to 32, which is the same. Hmm. But my swords will go up to 37. Whereas this, it's it won't be as good as Dragonbone, Dragonbane, or Chillrend. Let's go ahead and improve this guy. Okay, let me exit out of here. Hit P real quick. Uh, let's see. Fortify. Smithing. Oh, here we go. Oh, did the potion run out? I only did one thing. Does it only last for one thing? I thought it lasts for 30 seconds. And I can't improve any of these. What the hell? I should be able to. I bet it, I, it must have run out. I thought the timer was not going well. Interesting. Okay. Well, what that means is that I need to make more potions. So that'll take us to our next task. Um, and I, So we're going to leave off making that bow. For now, we're going to drop all our crafting gear in here. And we'll come back to it after I make more potions, set up the potion area. Uh, we'll keep the leather strips. What's my weight at? It's still too heavy. What do I have that is so heavy? Probably all this uh, ebony ebony stuff and all these pelts. That's all right. Uh, what's my leather situation doing? Looking like? Let's see. Leather, 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 leather. Leather, leather, leather. I've got tons of leather. Okay, so I don't need to do anything with these pelts. I can put those in an inventory in the box somewhere. Uh, okay, and then let's take off that. I wasn't even wearing the necklace. Damn it. Is that why? I don't know. I'm going to make more potions and then we'll come back to this. A little frustrating. Grr. Okay. Let's put these in this box over here. Ring, neck, chest, and bracers. All right. Oh, and now we're not encumbered. Lovely. Whoa. Okay, and then we need to set up a potion area. So uh, we're going to start planting stuff in here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we don't need um, any gear, like any enchanted items for that. So let's just grab... Oh boy, here we go, take all. And let's... <laughs> let's plant some stuff. Um, so let's see what we do. Ah, here we go. So I'd like to have um, one... Let's see how many basins. I have three. So let's see if we can make this one grow uh, smithing stuff. So for smithing, we need Spriggan Cap, Glowing Mushroom, Saber Cat Tooth, and Blister Wart. I don't think it's going to grow Saber Cat Teeth. But it will grow Blister Wart. And apparently I haven't discovered that property yet, but I looked up what does what just for this. 
Um, what about glow and mushroom? Okay, we're gonna do glow and mushroom. Just one. I didn't plant it. Okay. Whoa! It raised. Alright. So we did glowing mushroom. Let's do blister ward next. I didn't plant it. Yeah! Zoom! Okay. I don't know how long that takes to harvest. We'll find out, I guess. Uh, what's the other one? Spriggan cap? Do I have any? I wish this stuff was alphabetized. Oh, is it? It is. Hmm. I don't have any. Okay, but I have two, so that means I can make uh, smithing potions. Let's leave the other slots in there reserved for um, the other smithing thing. Okay, then for fortify enchanting, we can do uh, snowberry, sprigging cap, which I don't have. Hard raven claw, which won't grow in here, I don't think. Spawn ash, um, charis, charis hunter antennae, which also won't go. Uh, blue butterfly wing and ancestor moth wing, so... Snowberries is probably what it's going to be. So actually, hmm, let's go and put snowberries here then. Snowberries! One snowberry. Yeah, I didn't plant it. So, looks like we've got one slot left here, and I will reserve that for, uh, uh, what is it? Spriggan cap? Which will, um, which will do either enchanting or smithing. Uh huh. And then what? Let's see. What next? Um. So next we can do restore health and restore magicka. So let's do restore health in this central one. There's a lot of stuff that does that. Notably, uh, blue mountain flower, which I'm out of. I guess I used them all. Uh, what about wheat? Wheat. Okay. There's wheat, which stores health. Um, then we can do blister wart. Okay. Uh, let's see, blue dart wing. That's not going to grow in here. Uh, imp stool, imp stool, imp stool. All right. Awesome. And then we can do Swamp Fungal Pod next. Just go down the list, basically. Ooh, I didn't plant it. Yeah! So that's all four for this one. Let's just uh, keep moving down. Uh, so let's see, what did we do last? Swamp Fungal Pod, then we can do Eye of Saber Cat. Not gonna work! Um, Elves Ear! Elves Ear, will, will it? Or I've always seen those hanging. I've never seen those growing. Okay, I guess we can't do that. Um, I guess we can go on to restore magic. Uh, Red Mountain Flower. No. Okay, I don't have any. I'll have to. I'll have to go on a uh, look a run to look for this kind of stuff. What about Taproot? Did we already do this? I apparently don't have any. Uh, grass Pod. Oh, I do have this. Awesome. There we go. Um, oh, okay. And uh, let's see, what next? Dwarven oil won't work. Moon sugar won't work. Pretty sure. Oh, here's mountain flower. They're separate. Oh, oh, good. Did we use all four of these? I I didn't realize they were um, alphabetized like that. Okay, so I wanted uh, red. I think red and blue, right? Blue Mountain Flower. That restores health. Boink. And then Red Mountain Flower restores Magicka, I think. Uh, looking at my list here. Red Mountain, yes. That's right. And I think the uh, purple one restores stamina. Okay. Zink. Okay, and then for the last slot, um, grass pod, moon sugar, fire salts, frost salts, white cap, and pearl. 
White Cap. Did we already do White Cap? Fortify heavy armor, restore magic, a weakness to fire, ravage magic. I don't think so. Okay, let's do White Cap. Okay, there we go. There's our main three basins for Fortify Enchanting, Fortify Smithing, Restore Health, and Restore Magicka. Um, let's see. Then we've got one there, one there, and then four against the wall. So six more. Let's go and look at our Carpenter's Bench real quick. Mounted Mud Crab. You're damn straight. I'm putting a Mountain Mud Crib on the wall. Wall shelves, furniture... Uh, we're gonna wait for a while for that. Where's the mud 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 crab? Yeah. Um. Okay. Oh. Okay. So I think that's all I really want to do now. Um. As far as planting is go goes, uh, I'll tell you what. Leave suggestions on what I should put in the other ones. Maybe duplicates of these guys. Um, or maybe something else. So let me know what you think would be appropriate. Whoa! No, put those away, buddy. Okay, let's get these out. Okay, and let's see if I can make some uh, potions without waiting on that stuff. Let's see. Um, okay, here we go. Mary's ring, 15%. Thirty-seven percent, and I have one more. Forty-nine percent, almost fifty percent better. My potions, and I'm naked, more or less. Um, let's see, can I customize some? Oh yeah, I can. Okay, so I want to use, or is this to eat something? No. Okay, so I want to make. Uh, let's see, spring and sap. Do I have spring and sap? Well, yeah, it's friggin' sap. Oh, I wish I could scroll a little faster than using my scroll wheel. Spriggin- oh, I only have one. Okay, and then let's do... Um, glowing mushroom. You? Unknown effect. And, uh, let's see, uh, let's see, blister wart. And then, saber cat tooth. Do I have any of those? Wow, look at all these ingredients, crazy. Saber, I can't do three, or four. Okay, craft. Discovered! Fortify smithing, fortify smithing, fortify smithing! Yeah! Um, I still want to do one with Saber Cat Tooth and Glowing Mushroom to discover on that. Fortify Smithing. Okay, good. Now I know Fortify Smithing on all of those. Uh, let's do Fortify Enchanting. We want Snowberries. Let's unselect these, actually. Okay. Um, snowberries! Where are you at, Snowberries? Snowberries. And then we want Spriggan, Spriggan Sap. Where you at? Did I use it all? I may have used it all. I think I did. Okay, and then a Hargraven Claw. Uh, do I not have any? Did I use that too or something? I don't know. I guess I don't have any right now. Uh, let's see, spawn ash. Do I have any spawn ash? And once I discover these properties, I won't need to do it like this. I can just go into the prop into the category over here. I don't have any spawn ash. Uh, Chorus hunter antenna. I bet I have some of these. Where are you? There's one. Okay, and then a butterfly wing blue or a blue butterfly wing. Okay, and then an Ancestor Mothwing. Ancestor Mothwing. Is it our Mothwing Ancestor? Might be. Mountain Flower? Mum, mum, mum. No. Okay. Craft. Yeah! So, ooh, Stall Magic Regen, Fortify Conjuration, Fortify Enchanting. Nice. Okay. 
Um, so now from that point, we should now be able to go to Fortify Enchanting. Okay, I could make seven... Well, look at all those effects. <laughs> look how tiny the text is. Uh, conjuration spells 37% longer, decreased targets, magic regeneration by 100%. Uh, damages target stamina. Items are 7% stronger. Ooh, that's not very good. Only 7%. Man, that's sucky. Uh, what are, let's try smithing. Hey, hey, 30% better. Still 30% better. Let's just make several of these. Alright, that'll do me for smithing potions for a while. And now enchanting potions. 7% better. That's almost not worth it. I can buy much better potions from, uh, from alchemists. And while we're here, let's do some restore health. And uh, we don't want to... Um, we want to combine everything with mountain flower because I got a zillion of them. Don't want to use the Daedra Heart. That's a little bit too valuable. And we'll keep the Saber Cat Eye mm, for something else. Skeever, though, we'll get rid of that. And the Wheat is for... Yeah, we can use that one. What about magic? Are we want to do any of these? Nah, whatever. It's fine. Quit alchemy. Okay, and then we can... Uh, you know what? I'm going to keep my... I'm going to drop all the items in here. But I'm going to keep my uh, bonus stuff on me because I'm going to be enchanting stuff in a little bit. Okay, let's give this smithing stuff a uh, another chance. Got my smithing stuff on. Let's see if we can improve this better now. Uh, oh, now it's letting me uh, improve things like children again. Did I go up in skill or something? I don't know what the hell is going on. But uh, let's quaff a potion. Let's see, fortify enchanting. I ate this by accident when I was uh, getting stuff to and from a chest. Smith chest, bracer, smith chest, smith chest. Uh, those are from the ring and the necklace or whatever. They're not from the chest. So let's quaff a potion. Now that I have a lot of them, Fortify Enchanting, Fortify Smithing 11, 30%, Fortify Smithing 2, so these are the same, I have 12, uh, that's it, I thought I had another one, I guess not, okay, so they're all the same, let's take that one, use this, Children now goes up another couple of points, that goes up to 63, Damn it, I heard he used... Ah. That one goes up to 45. I don't know what's going on. Okay, let's just use it. Let's use it! Craft, okay, and then daggers go up to 41. These guys only go up to 38. Alright, new dagger time! Wait, what happened? No, no, use it. <laughs> what the hell is going on with this UI? Now they don't... Uh, I think my potion ran out. Uh, let's look in the powers tab. Fortify smithing. Yeah, this is a little bit confusing. I'm not sure what's going on. Let's try again. Okay, Ebony Bow doesn't go up any higher. Dagger's up to 41. Scrapple goes up to 38. Let's do the dagger. Craft. Dagger. Okay. So now these are both at 31. Okay, that'll go up to 46. Where's my other one? Uh, that goes up to 44. Oh, so they will be better. Alright, let's make some new swords. I've been using the same swords a long time. That one now... Okay, my potion ran out. 
So it does, the timer is ticking when you're in this inventory screen. I think I've confirmed that. So let's quaff another potion. Good thing I made a bunch of them. Okay. Uh, ebony sword. Craft. Uh, we'll leave that the way it is. We'll leave that the way it is. Uh, we'll leave that the way it is. Oh, did I not have Moonstone? Maybe that's why I can't see some of these. That must be it. Okay, let's pick up some Moonstone. Uh-huh, Moonstone. That's what happened. Ingots, Moonstone. Okay, still encumbered. What a surprise. And my potion is probably done by now. Let's see, Fortify Smithine. Yeah, but let's uh, let's look in the inventory screen here first so we can plan it out a little bit. So I want to try to upgrade these four guys with Malachite. Uh, the emerald stuff. Leather boots, maybe. If that'll improve any, I'll do that. Then what? Um, yeah, I guess mostly just the emerald stuff. Okay. So let's make take one more potion and try to get this all done within one potion. Okay, use. Okay, emerald boots up to 42. 107. 42. 49. Yeah. Oh, I can do it again. Okay. Keep going. I don't know why, but okay. Sweet. Uh, we'll do that one too for fun. Yeah, let's let's make the boots better too. Why not? Awesome. Okay, so we're done smithing and we're done planting crops. <laughs> now this stuff is way better. Up to 113. I would like to make a new set of armor as well, but I don't have a, a, an upgrade as far as light armor is concerned. So now we can put our smithing stuff back in here. Let's see, we'll put store you, store you, store you, and then bracers of smithing. Yeah. Oh, actually, no, no. Bring those back. Because I want to see if I can improve those enchanting wise. But I can't put all my crafting uh, blacksmithing stuff back in here. Let's see. Um, we can put malachite, moonstone. I'll keep the leather. Uh, am I under? Not yet. What is taking up all that weight? Probably all the duplicate items I'm carrying. Hmm. Okay. Whatever. I'll just stagger around slowly. Let's head up to uh, the enchanting area. Okay, so I only have uh, two... Fortify enchanting potions at the moment. Well, I have this one, but it's not nearly as good. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of uh, prep to look at stuff first. First thing I want to see... I don't have anything to disenchant. No. Uh, first thing I want to see is if I can improve on the enchants of uh, some of my alchemy and smithing items. So first thing I want to look at... Uh, let's see... 22% potions. 30%. Oh, not pickpocket. I don't care about that. 20% uh, weapons and armor. Let's see, what do we have in rings and necks? Uh, weapons and armor, 12% better. 12% better. So, chest, ring, neck, 12% better. Seems to be what I can enchant. Um, this one I found that I probably won't be able to enchant that good. So, can we get better than 12% is basically what I'm looking for. So, let's pick first um, one of these nice gold diamond necklaces I made worth 1,200. Then we're going to go fortify alchemy, already at 13%. With the soul gem black, 
Okay, and that's without a potion. Uh, quit enchanting, yes. So now let's compare that. Uh, I don't know what my actual one is. Creative potions are 12, so moderately better. Not, not a whole lot. Um, just want to check that make sure that it's the same. Um, all right. Let's see. What about... Let's get the enchantment first and then see what's available for smithing. Fortify. Fortify, fortify, fortify. Lots of fortifies here. Smithing. Item. 13%. So only incrementally better than what I had before. And then we're going to have a potion. Yeah, okay, so that's what I wanted to know. I don't think it's worth upgrading my uh, smithing and alchemy stuff right now. So what I'm going to spend my time working on, because I only have a few potions, so, and like, as we've <laughs> illustrated, the clock is ticking. Quit? No, don't quit yet. Um, so we're going to... See, take that off. Then we want... Let's do the daggers. Have any dagger? Oh, crap. When do I get to rename them? How do you rename them? <laughs> it's in this, isn't it? I thought so, maybe not. Yeah, I think it is. Um, item. Then we'll go soul gem. Oh, different. Uh, soul gem five. And then we'll say we could do absorb health for 11 points. Or we could do fiery. What's going on? Fire. Fiery Soul Trap! If the target dies, fills a soul gem, burns the target for 10 points. Uh, the only problem with this is everything you kill is going to fill a soul trap, or fill a soul gem, and it might fill stuff you don't want filled, so I don't actually want that on these daggers. Okay, no. Fire damage, 17 points. Nope. Frost damage, 17. Paralyze is very handy, 2 points. Shock damage. Um, let's see, what else we got? Anything else? That's it. And what does Scrapple do? Scrapple, uh, I think... I think that Scrapple... Absorbs health. So maybe we'll do something different. Maybe we'll do like a Fire and Ice or Fire and Lightning. Fire and Shock. 17... 17 and 20. Okay. Quit. Yep. Let's quit once more. Quaff a potion. What are Scrapple doing? Absorb 10 points. Okay, let's do something else then. Because usually when I'm backstabbing somebody, I'm already at full health anyway, so I don't really need that. Okay. I. Uh, bleh, Ebony Dagger. Soul Gem. Black. Enchantment. Um, let's do, let's do shock on one and fire on the other. Oh, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't take my potion, God. Quit enchanting, one more time. Okay. Item, ebony dagger, soul, black, enchantment. Shock damage. Yes. Now we can rename. Okay, we're going to call these. We already have Scrapple. Left and right. These guys are a little bit darker. Alright, we'll call this Scrambled Eggs. Right. And let's craft it. Yeah. And then let's do the other one. Hopefully my potion is still active. I hope so. Ebony Dagger. Black Soul Gem. Uh, fire. No, it ran out. Damn. Um. Okay, let's take another potion then. What if I enchant it? Oops. Get in there. The clock's ticking. Okay, item. How many dagger? Soul gem. Black. Enchantment. F 
fire damage. Okay, and then we're gonna rename that. Oh wait, press put oh, that only went up to 18? That's not very good. F. Okay, and then we want to turn that to scrambled eggs left. Okay. Graft. Smack. There we go. Let's look at our new daggers. Scrambled eggs left, scrambled eggs right. 41 damage. That's a pretty big upgrade over uh, Scrapple. <laughs> okay, let's unfavorite these. Go into Q. Weapons. I guess they're over here, aren't they? Okay, so then we'll go... Um, one, two... Yeah! That's right, I'm encumbered, but I can still sw sling daggers like a pro. Okay, so I'm out of uh, I'm out of potions, so I'm actually gonna end the video here. It's probably been pretty long, and uh, we'll finish enchanting stuff maybe next time when I have more potions. Oh man, I'm so encumbered. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Next time, we'll go back to uh, probably end up doing some more vampire stuff. See you later, guys. Take it easy. Have a good day. Ching.